how to set up the iPhone 14 series for the first time. So first press on the power button on the side, press and hold and this will allow you to switch up your iPhone. Now in this video we're just going to try to quickly set up the iPhone uh, so that we can get to the home screen without having too much uh, issue. So when you first turn on the phone you should see the screen say hello. Now swipe up and then select a language that you want to use. Next select your region and then tap on it. So tap on the language region that you want to use. Down here tap on set up manually. Next you can tap on choose a Wi-Fi network and I'm just going to uh, tap on cancel, give it a few moments so that you can pick up your Wi-Fi wi network and then I'm going to tap on my Wi-Fi network and here put in your Wi-Fi password once you have put in the password tap on the join button and this will allow the phone to join the Wi-Fi network now if this is the first time that you have um, set up your iPhone then the iPhone will uh, attempt to activate uh, the iPhone with the Apple server. This is also the date when your warranty will start to apply. So it will apply, your warranty will apply from today, the first time that you set up your phone. Now tap on the continue button. Then at this point, if you want, you can set up Face ID now, or you can do that later in settings. I'm going to choose set up later. And at this point, you can create a passcode. Now tap on the passcode options to use a simple four digit numeric code, uh, custom numeric code, custom alpha numeric code, or don't use passcode. So that's up to you. Uh, I'm going to put in one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I'm going to put in the same password again to confirm. Okay, after that, uh, on this screen here, it will give you an option to uh, transfer your data over. You can restore your data from the iCloud backup. Uh, you can restore it from a Mac or a PC. If you have a backup on the computer, PC computer, you can restore it now. You can also transfer it directly from iPhone. So if you have an older iPhone, you can select this option. If you have an Android uh, device, you can also choose move data from Android. Otherwise, choose don't transfer apps and data. So if this is the first time that you are using a smartphone, uh, then you probably can choose just don't transfer apps and data. Next in here, you will need to create an Apple ID. So if you haven't got an Apple ID before, you can create a new one. If you do already have an Apple ID, you can put in here your Apple ID and tap on the next button. Now if you don't have one, you can tap on forgot password or I don't have an Apple ID. In here you can create a free Apple ID. Uh, you can choose set up later in settings. So I'm going to choose set up later in settings and then I'll tap on don't use. Next tap on agree and then tap on continued. Then it say iMessage and FaceTime. Do you want to set up now? I'm going to choose not now. And then tap on enable or disable location services. I'm going to choose enable location services. Next, it's a set up mobile. You can transfer a phone number from a nearby iPhone or scan QR code provided by your service provider. So you can set up your, um, your eSIM card or you can uh, use the QR code. So I'm going to do set up later. I'm, I choose set up later in settings and then tap on skip. Just skip eSIM setup. And here you can choose to set up Siri now or you can set up Siri later in settings. So I'm going to choose set up later in settings as well. And next is the screen time. You can choose to set up your screen time now or uh, later in settings. Again, I'm going to choose set up later in settings. And in here you can choose to share with Apple or don't share. And finally, you can choose the appearance, light theme or dark theme and tap on the continue button. And display zoom, do you want to have it a zoom in a version or a standard version and then tap on continued and emergency SOS tap on continued and lastly you can now swipe up to go to your home screen
So there are a lot of things that you need to set up uh, in order for you to get to the home screen. Now say set up mobile, set up your eSIM for this iPhone to use your phone number and connect to mobile data. I'm going to choose not now and uh, anytime that anything that we have skipped uh, during the setup you can always go into settings here and set up you can sign to your Apple ID you can uh, set up your Wi-Fi uh, Bluetooth and mobile data you can set mobile in here to that will allow you to uh, um, sign to your eSIM or if you have a SIM card you can insert a SIM card on the side here and then in here you can set up your focus notifications, sound, screen time, and so much more uh, with all the settings in here available for you to, uh, to set up. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.